I... I just had to. I just had to. That's gonna be the thumbnail. I just... I couldn't... I couldn't help it. So you're welcome, audience. Are they on the boat, or are they somewhere else? Anyway. So we are... Oh, hey, buddy. <laughs> Those pirates didn't seem to give you much trouble at all. I mean... Back in my day, a pirate knew how to fight. Back in my day. Ones are soft and weak. One of them knew Cow magic. Everything. I tried to tell them, but nobody listened. Is that... You'd think the Lotus is that Steve Bloom? Warning. Even a pirate knows better than to get mixed up with them. Tell me about Gal. Gal the Greater uh, okay. calls himself is the leader of the guild. The Powerful guild. Crime syndicate. They never used to bother with us until Gal came to power. How generic. Gal himself came and took over our operations. I mean, he began building the flyers, and he made slaving our main activity. My own men turned on me. Now they treat me like a dog. Woof. A few months later, the Lotus Assassin showed up. Gal must have some kind of deal worked out with them. Whatever they're up to, it must be something big. Mm. I'll deal with it. They showed up shortly after Gal. Tell me about the Lotus Assassin. Working with him and his guild. Inquisitor Lim seems to be in charge of the Lotus Assassins here. Looks like I've got an Gal Inquisitor to kill. Don't get along. They both like to be in charge. Be careful if you run into Lim. There's something very wrong about him. I'm sure. There's something wrong with all of them. Um, tell me about Gal. Gal the Greater, as he called. Oh, you already said that. All right, goodbye. Watch yourself in this place. One minute you're on top, and the next you're on the bottom, bowing and scraping. I'm not here to be on either side of the top or bottom. In fact, I'm more of a middle anyway. If that is even a thing, I don't know. There we go. That was awkward. <laughs> yes, I destroyed the bridge anyway. The, the pier anyway. Hmm. What's here? Leaping tiger. Well, hello. Dude, dude. Change targets. Oh, okay. That's how I do it. Oh, God. Get out of here. Back up. Just because I'm jealous of your shirt. Your top. No. No. I want your top. Do the thing. That's not how I want to go. I need Do that again. And again. And again. Well, that worked. Okay. And... Down you go. Spirit thief. See if I can get some chi back. Or some this focus. Yeah, I think it's chi. Poke, poke. Leaping 
Alright, that worked. What's up, girl? Welcome back to being a person. Alright. The History of Flight, Volume 1. The first person to have flim uh, flimped. I combined attempt and flight. Don't know why. Anyway, the first person to attempt flight was Cao Xiong, an early scholar who originally came from the prosperous east. Though his ideas were creative, they were hardly sound. Cao Xiong met an early end after he strapped several canisters of dragon powder to a bamboo chair and ignited it, and he exploded. It was, it was at first rumored that he had survived the ill-fated mission, but few truly believe that anyone could have survived such a disastrous explosion. His death, however, was not completely in vain. Several of his writings were studied by later scholars, and some of his ideas were adapted for the first successful human flights. Well, that's good. Kind of sad I can't smash things. Like, after combat. Just, well, I guess I, I can smash things. Never mind. What's this? Can't do anything with it? Okay. Can I smash this? Nope. Okay. Well, deeper into the pirates, I cove home thing. Oh, right into a save point. What's up, buddy? I see you. <coughs> Thank you, cutscene, for telling me that I'm in the middle of a cutscene. And for the guard just falling asleep. Who are you? If you scum have any sense at all, you'll stand aside. Let me go drive a blade through your master's throat, and I'll forget I saw you. Why not go through the oh, heart, certainly. like we'll most people? Let you stroll upstairs to kill our leader. I mean, Can I'll do it. If we drew you a map to his room? Yes. Um, I don't think Gao would like. No shit. Dumbass. I wasn't serious, you idiot. We're going to kill this intruder. Is that a necklace or is that like drinking. a seam? He's just one man. He can't beat all of us. There's a Look lot around. of bodies down there. The odds are not so much in your favor. There's still a chance for you to run. Just what because you, you have two swords doesn't mean they're outnumbered. You haven't noticed my partner over there watching us? Thanks. Don't let her grace and beauty fool you. She's deadly. Uh-huh. This is your last chance to get out of here alive. So, partner, huh? The thief brought a friend. That just means you won't die alone. Attack! Oh no, not again. Oh jeez, come on. Die quietly. That was not the way I wanted to go. And that's one down. Guardians for chumps anyway. Are you dead? Yes? Okay. Uh, let's do this. I'm gonna poke you. Dude, I just want to get some chi back from you. Fine, I will kill you. Well, thank you. 
I am not your partner, dude. How do I know you'd be deadly in a fight? I got here by myself. My apologies well, apologies for dragging you into that, but I can't afford to be stopped. Not now. Mm-hmm. My name is Sky. Of course it's good it is. to see there's someone else in this place who can't stand these slaving dogs. We make quite the pain. I'm just here for a wind map, actually. Good thing I was here to save you. Indeed. I find I'm just not saved enough these days. Shame that. <laughs> It was obvious you weren't with the pirates. Why not deal with them quickly? There's bigger game above us. Speaking of which, there's a very secure and equally intimidating gate blocking the way. If we work together, though, it'll be simple to crack. Uh, I need a wind map. How do you know your way around this place so well? It's funny what things you can learn if you just ask at the right time. Like when, when you have a knife to someone's throat. Or when they're drunk. Things like how to reach the upper levels of this place, despite that security door. Are you talking about the bamboo door that you smashed? Where are you here? I'm here on a personal matter. Of course. A man in this place took something very valuable from me, and I intend to repay him the favor. Okay. Is this man Gal if the Greater? more time, I'd want to know what brought you here. I expect it's quite the tale. Not really. Just burning. Yes, I Lots hunt down the greater, though I will not say why. It is a personal matter. Damn. You're not gonna... You're not gonna talk? Okay, <laughs> I'll talk for you. I won't be stopped now that I'm this close. And luckily you're here. That will make it easier to reach the upper levels where he hides himself away. There, I did it. You happy? How do I know I can trust you? You're here for your reasons, and I'm here for mine. Somehow I doubt they conflict. Besides, we'll need each other's help to get through that door. I have a demon. So about this plan of yours. How do we get past the door? The door at the top of this stair is locked through a fairly ingenious mechanism. Gao's engineer, Kang the Man, designed it for security. Okay. I don't think pirates are as... Are, I don't think of pirates as the ingenious type. Oh, I don't know. They're good with knots. Didn't. Kang the Mad is a crafty fellow. The door requires two to unlock it. Up high there is a platform with the release lever. Fair. The door must be operated while the lever is held forward. There used to be a sentry up there who handled that kind of thing, but uh, he had an accident. Okay. I can climb up and pull the lever easily enough. You can open the door when it's unlocked. And then you just slip on through? That seems awfully convenient. Still don't trust my intentions? Nope. Have a little faith that sometimes fate provides answers when they're needed most. Either way, we need to deal with that door. All right. Once the door is open, you we got can go me. our separate ways. I have my goals, and I'm sure you have yours. Since we both have much to do, why don't I go and lock the door now? Okay. Uh, very well. Go unlock the door. If you betray me, I'll kill you. Why don't we work together after the door's open? Coming from you, that's a tempting offer. I'm a fool to turn you down. But I think what I've come here to do is something I must do alone. Fair. I should go now, but I have to ask in case we never meet again. Where did you study? Um, at the same place where I learned to mind my own business. He must have been a genius, Master Lee. Fight like no one I've seen before, or not a genius. That could be both a compliment or a insult. I've heard this kind of thing before. Why? What's so strange about how I fight? It's not so much strange as it is intriguing. Oh no. No one I've ever met fights like you do. It's subtle, but your movements bait your foes into seeing an opening that isn't there. Hey, that's not true. Trap. I get the crap kicked out of me, and then I heal myself. I mean, if that's if that's what you say, subtle. I'm sorry. I'm wasting time <laughs> neither of us can spare. I'll get ready and pull the lever when you're near the door. Good luck with whatever brought you to this place. Okay. I know you. I saw you at Tian's Landing. I'm Yong Yifong. Do you remember me? 
My daughter and I left town to try our luck in the wilderness. And you ended up here when I told you not to go. How did you end up here? We didn't get far outside the town before a flyer landed right in front of us. Of course. These pirates dragged us inside and brought us here to sell us slaves. They took... They, they took Fio, Fio Yao, my daughter, and they took her to the upper levels. I can't leave without her. Please, you have to find Fio Yao. Don't worry, I'll find her. The slave breaker took her, of course. Please don't let him hurt my Fio Yao. Please, find my daughter and bring her back to me. Where's the door? I'm assuming that's a cell and not the door. That's a battering ram. That's a body. I had 45 silver on it. So I go up here, and there's a monkey, and there's the door. What's up, buddy? Dude, I can't see anything. Just go away. I don't consider my fighting style subtle. In fact, I consider it very aggressive. One might say relentless. There. Let's get my focus back. Or my chi back. And I'm on fire. That's cool. That's what I wanted. I wanted to be on fire. It felt good, okay? Uh, what am I looking at now? Okay. Mistress, I am almost ready to return to the Imperial City. Okay, Another emo day, dude. And I will bring you Is that hair or fight. like a bandana? I lose Over your confidence eye. in you with each passing hour, Lim. You should have been back by now. Why haven't you ordered Gao to grant you one of his flyers? Mistress, Gao's ships are only small flyers. They're good for short range flights and raiding villages, but not for long journeys. That's why I haven't returned yet. I'm gonna have to Don't fight you, aren't I? In your failings on me, Lim. I've delivered everything I promised. It's only a matter of time until I finish the special dragonfly to transport the artifact to the Imperial City. So I'm assuming I'm going to steal that from him. I designed that dragonfly. I built it, not Gao. That dragonfly is Kang's masterpiece. You speak to you about yourself in the third person. I've heard oh, rumors of a spy disrupting our operations in the Southland. I'm no spy. This is all too much for you to handle. Perhaps I should come out there personally. That will not be necessary, mistress. I will deal with the troublemaker here and return to the Imperial City in one day. Is that, um... You heard mistress Gia. I don't know who that is. Can't waste any more time here. He's in Get Mass Effect. Flyer finished. Now. Ah, yes, Reapers. That guy. Gia is not my mistress, Lim, and I don't take orders from you either. Remember... If not for my son, you would never have discovered where the glorious strategist was hiding. I am well aware of your son's role in all this, Gal. In fact, in, I suspect in I all of this. About him than you do. What are you talking about? Have you heard something about young Gal? Tell me. He's totally dead. I of murdered course, him. Of course, Gal. Of course. Just waiting for the perfect time to tell you. I received a report from the destruction of two rivers. Your son, Gal the Lesser, is dead. No, he's not. No, I mean, you said it like that. This can't be. It's a lie. You lie. I speak the truth. 
It seems your son was no match for one of the other students. From the condition of his body, it sounds like he died quite painfully. I mean, I let him run away. No, young Gao was everything to me. Damn you and your black heart. Damn you. Damn you. Damn you. I want to be alone. I, I must grieve for my son. No one is to disturb me. No one. <laughs> if I can get to what the a run. city fast enough, I can give the amulet fragment to Death's Hand himself. Then Grand Inquisitor Jia may be in for a surprise. We shall see. We shall see. Get to work, mad fool. Do whatever it takes to get that ship built. I will take a short-range flyer and check on some of our other operations in the area. In the area. If the marvelous dragonfly is not ready to launch when I return, those captive demons will have a new playmate. I mean... Interruptions. Who designed that dragonfly? Who did build something to make his sandals explode? Okay. Seems legit. And... Blurry cutscene. Got it. You! Kaboom. Well, he's dead. I thought the explosion encompassed you guys, too. Thing, but uh, kicking worked well too. I mean, it's what I do. Who are you? I am Kang, the man. I make things explode, and I make things fly, and I'm very good at both. The things I fly tend to survive. The well, that's good. I explode, not so much. Hopefully, you don't make a flying thing that explodes. You build flyers. Do I build flyers? Do I build flyers? Uh, yes. Have you heard differently? Yeah. Fantastical things, but misused by Gao and his cohorts. I have saved the best for myself. Oh, good. My greatest invention is in the launch room upstairs. Light and fast, she has weapons and capacity no other flyer does. The marvelous dragonfly. You built a you built Gao a special flyer. Under protest, Gao does not appreciate what I make. He misuses, and worse, he duplicates and diminishes their glory. Well, no more. The dragonfly will not function. Why not? Gao wants to give my machine to the Lotus Assassins, but I stopped him. I hid the extraneous dust inductor Well, no one will find it. <laughs> Try to fly without that. Can but you find it? can make a new inductor. It is extraneous after uh, I mean... So, a few days ago... I blew up the inscrutable power Ugh. source. Now the dragonfly can only make sure harm. Will you help me against Gao and the Lotus Assassins? Yes, yes, of course. What do you think I've been saying? You need to listen more carefully. Um. If you stage a combat-related accident for Gao, like falling down a flight of punches, nice. I'll replace the inductor on the dragonfly, and we can fly away. What do you say? I will definitely help him fly down a flight of punches. You are sure to profit from this partnership. In fact, I've never accidentally exploded anyone traveling with me, so that alone is a benefit of my presence. Well, that's good. Anyway, you go ahead, and once all the kicking is done, I'll come along and we'll see what's what. Uh, for now, let me think. Uh, we'll need explosives that explode. I'm sure. Goodbye. Yes, goodbye. Go and leave me to think. I like you. All right, let's level up. Keep on body. Done. Eight style points, huh? Um. Oh, dang it. Well, that's not gonna work. 
I have been using Spirit Thief, and I need to level it up so I get more chi. Make it go faster. There. All right, that should work. <laughs>